What's up guys, welcome back to another video. I don't know if you can tell, <laughs> but it's windy out. Um, getting things set up right now. Uh, I've got my new bow right here. The Hoyt Ventum 30. This first whitetail hunt it's gonna be on. It is uh, December 27th, so this is a late season hunt. I'm gonna be hunting just off of this cut cornfield about 60 yards into the tree line. Hopefully gonna catch these deer. Moving out to get something to eat tonight, but again, it's extremely windy. I gotta get everything set up and I actually have to uh, hang a tree stand where I wanna hunt tonight because I have the tree prepped, I just don't have a stand in it. So I'm gonna try to get in there a little bit early, throw that tree stand in, get my camera arm all set up and uh, Hopefully don't get blown out of the tree. That's why we got a harness. But it's gonna be a fun hunt tonight, so we'll see you guys when I start heading in. Here's the tree. Plenty of trails going back and forth here, so get this stand hung and crawl up in it. Hopefully, I don't get blown around too bad. Right up there. All right, got the tree stand hung. Now I'm just putting on my warm weather gear. Got these uh, King's Anorak and Wind Defender bibs. I'm gonna throw these on before I head up the tree so I'm nice and warm. And then uh, I've got about two and a half hours till dark, so hopefully something comes in. <laughs> Thank you. 
no way. Oh my gosh. I think I just heard him fall. No way. Guys, I finally did it. I just smoked that puppy. Oh, there's 25 deer around me. Just got it done, baby. <laughs> no way. Oh, I'm so freaking pumped. Oh, I gotta get this focused. Where's the focus? Oh my gosh. Guys, it, I have been hunting so hard all year long and I just freaking heart shot that buck right here at 15 yards. <laughs> I said a prayer coming in here, did this hanging hunt. Uh, I just said, Lord, please, if it's, if it's gonna happen, please give me the opportunity tonight because I don't have any more days to hunt before I leave for Arizona and then it's the end of the year. I cannot believe I just filled my freaking buck tag in Nebraska this late in the game. Oh my gosh. I just got it done with the brand new Hoyt Ventum 30. Just got this bow dialed in on Christmas Day. I had this buck come in right here, 15 yards. I made sure that I was dialed in. He was quartered to me. I just buried that pin on his heart and I absolutely smoked him. I hit him with a slick trick standard and it blew clean through him. I think my arrow's in the ground right there. That buck's deader than dead. There's no way. Like, I absolutely smoked that deer. Oh, thank you, Lord. Call my buddy Wes. Yo, what up, dude? Dude, I just filled my tag in Nebraska. No! I'm not even kidding, dude. Bottom of the ninth. What, dude? Dude, I just smoked him right here at what 15 happened, yards man? with the brand new bow. Dude, that is awesome, bro. Oh, I'm shaking so what hard. Happened, dude? dude, I absolutely center punched his heart. Oh my god, so you know he's dead. Did you watch him fall down? I didn't watch him, but he took, he, dude, he took off like he got hit by a freight truck. And yeah. I think I heard him fall in the cornfield. Dude, I had, I had 25, 30 deer all around me. Well, I'll call you back. Yo, okay, all right. All right, bye. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get down while I still have light, and uh, go check that arrow. Oh my gosh, I'm freaking shaking, guys. Go check that arrow, and uh, go see if I can find him. I think I heard him fall in that field, so. <laughs> I cannot believe that. Oh my gosh, God is so good. I was praying about this one, man. I can't believe that just happened. There it is. Oh. Oh, that's great blood. Oh man. That's great blood. Full pass through. Yes. What I'm gonna do is just get to the field edge and glass and uh, see if I can see him laying there. Otherwise, I'll come back here and pick up on a blood trail. But I gotta go back to the truck and get a light. I left my light in the truck, so. I guarantee he's laying right up here though. Oh, there's blood all over right here. Right there. Is that him? I think he's right here. He's right here, baby. He's right here. Oh my gosh. Yes. He's dead right here. 
Oh, thank you, Lord. Oh, he's got a big body. You guys don't know how much this deer means to me. Just a nice eight. Just a really nice eight pointer. <sighs> Woo! Oh. <laughs> yes! Alright guys, well, here he is. Um, I had almost started to believe that it was not gonna happen for me this year. I've been hunting my butt off. I mean, you guys have seen that through the rotation series, but uh, I came out here with the hope that these deer would be moving out to this cornfield and feeding tonight. And the way I set up with that hanging hunt, man, I played the wind just right. And these deer came in on the left side of the tree. And uh, you guys saw it on video, there were deer running everywhere. I mean, even behind me, there were deer running behind me that I didn't even know were there. So they were piled up in that draw and this guy came through, gave me a shot at 15 yards. He was quartering two a little bit and uh, I knew that I was shooting a fixed blade broadhead. I shot him with a slick trick standard and uh, put this new Ventum 30 from Hoyt to work and it blew through the shoulder, clean pass through and stuck in the ground on the backside. So um, I gotta say, I'm pretty impressed with this bow. It's a, it's a shooter and man, it packs a punch. So I'm, uh, I'm just so dang grateful for this deer. Like I say, guys, I've, I've been struggling this year. And uh, my buddy Jared, he's sitting behind the camera right now. He came out to uh, help me pick this deer up, throw it in the back of the truck. It's nice because we're able to drive the trucks right up to him, but uh, he's been struggling too. I mean, we've been, we were just talking about that. This whole year, I don't know, I, I've had so many buddies who haven't shot deer this year. And I don't know if it was just due to the poor weather, it was hot during the rut, um, but man, here late season, got it done. I couldn't be more excited. Guys, I appreciate you watching this video. If you liked it, please remember to smash that subscribe button, give this video a like, and uh, we're gonna get this thing taken care of, loaded in the back of the truck, and uh, I'll be having backstrap tonight. I'm so excited. Appreciate it, guys. We'll catch you on the next one.